we just found out that there's going to be a conclusion to the conflict between Jama and um, Tara. Sorry, I was going to say Maggie. Um, Tara this season. So, we'll talk a little bit about how those two are going to face off. There's going to be a what? Resolution to the conflict? Yeah. He said somebody's going to win. Oh. You know what? I don't exactly know. Yeah. There's definitely conflict. But not so much right at the beginning of the season. Right at the beginning of the season, we will see, you know, she's going to get out of jail. Well, I can't even say it. She's going to get out of jail. She's in jail right now. So, um, uh, you'll have to tune in to see what happens with that. Yeah, there's definitely some conflict. Well, there's always conflict between her and Tara. What, Kurt said somebody was going to win? Yeah. Oh, see, I don't know. Yeah, he said he knows that each season has been ending like Tara behind Jack, you behind Jack, and I guess there will be an answer to that. Oh, well, I'll have to tune in. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I, t I have to tell you, I don't really know week to week. <laughs> but literally, I'm with everybody else. You yeah. just kind of get the scripts and see what happens. Jack kind of won in the end of the season. Is this just something she's really going to clung on to moving forward? Kind of stay in Jack's ear and, and yeah. Oh yes. Plus, you know, she's got that new hot boyfriend. She loves that. She's very happy. She's glad Clay's in jail. She just is, even though it was under very conflicting circumstance. I think that there are people. They, they don't stay in con They don't stay in that like should I, shouldn't I? They don't go to that place. You know, I think that's the decisions made at the time. And he had kind of crossed a line with her that was too far to come back from. So she's in a pretty good place, and I think that she's in better graces with her son, which is ultimately always with her. I think that she really likes that he's the president, and I think it remains to be seen what kind of president he will become. So in a way, she's getting everything she wanted. You know, you also have to know, though, that the season between five and six is only about three days. So, you know, the Tara of it all and the grandchildren of it all, you know, starts to pick up. At the beginning, um, Gemma wanted Jax to follow Clay's lead instead of John's. But now with what's gone on with Clay, what kind of leader does Gemma want Jax to be at this point? I don't know if there's a one answer to that. I think it's like... You know how you're a kid and you grow up and you say, I'm never going to be like my mom. I don't want to be like my mom. And then be nice to you, you're sort of like your mom. So I think that all those influences will, will influence Jacks. A little bit of the John Teller, a little bit of Clay. I think the conflict will come in here trying to figure out who he is. And um, I don't know that Gemma... Her goal is to keep that goal together, period. I think at the end of the day, she doesn't care how it happens. You know, but that's the ultimate, that's the main goal. The assumption was that she, you know, called Tara's bluff and turned her in at the end of the season, but I know when I talked to Kurt after it aired, he said, I'm not going to answer it definitively. Is that something we'll receive an answer for? Yes. Okay. Were you surprised by the answer, or...? I was happy to hear that the one hopeful kind of thread in this season is going to be your relationship with Nero. Um, and what type of, like, will that give Gemma a bit of a different perspective on life? Because she's been so married to that club for so long, seeing that, you know, there's a brighter side to life in a way. Yeah, I think so. Because her relationship with Nero is, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a sweeter love. It's not a... You know, he's not as brutal a character as Clay. Um, he's a more, you know, he comes from the OG life, but he's, he's got a bigger part, I think. Or, or not, he's just not as ruthless. So I think she sees that, and I think she responds very much to so. Because I never think of her, I mean, she's kind of cutthroat, but she's very big hearted. You know, she's, she's very big hearted. I think it's consistent in that, you know, we're telling, you know, Kurt's telling a, a big seven season arc. Mm -hmm. So I think it's consistent with where it's been going. I think it's going to be an awesome season. I mean, you know, the stakes are higher, the, the, the relationships are more intense. You know, you have to really imagine what it must be like to live in a world like that. Because I don't think there's a lot of longevity. Mm -hmm. 
You know, I don't think that, you know, they're like you or I. You know, they're always on guard. They're always, you know, it's really nice. So, it will continue to be that.